The sounds of the Caribbean filled the North Peace Cultural Center Theater on Saturday night as the Steel Band entertained the crowd. Black History Month was the celebration and residents from Fort St. John came out for the festivities. The event hosted by the Pan-African Caribbean Association included Caribbean and African food, a steel band that came from Calgary, and a fashion show. President of PACA, Panabi Obo, says the event was for the community to come together, learn more about the different cultures, and try the delicious food. So many people don't know much about us and what we're about, and um, they don't have the opportunity to eat our cuisine because it's not available in town right here. So we thought, okay, let's celebrate Black History Month along with others so that they will have a feel of what is happening here and, and know more about us and what we stand for. This was the sixth time the event took place in Fort St. John and it was a full house. Even Mayor Lori Ackerman and Councillor Larry Evans were enjoying the celebration. Councillor Evans says there has been increasing awareness around the city that February is the month to celebrate and reflect on black history. When it first came along, a lot of people, you know, uh, didn't you know didn't quite get the message but over the years it has been put out there more and more and uh, I think it, it, it's, it's become a mainstay for February. Many members of the black community came out to socialize with people of the same ethnic background but also came to enjoy the one-of-a-kind home cooking they can't get in the city. I feel awesome and wonderful like I actually ate my Nigerian food, food I've been missing for a while now. The event ended with a showcase of various outfits from Africa and the Caribbean, and then the steel band played into the night. PACA plans on organizing more events throughout the year, including their annual picnic in July. Carissa Wilson, CJDC-TV News, Fort St. John.